Okay, I want to show you guys something. I am going to give you a code here. All right, you each get a code. And everyone has to do this if you're an eighth grader. This is your username and that's your password. You're gonna to go to the career cruising website, careercruising.com, and you will enter that code right here, okay? And your password. And then you're gonna click sign in. I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'll show you. All right, I'm gonna sign in as Joshua. Uh, here's here's what it looks like, okay? This is what it's going to look like. You have to first agree to the terms and conditions and enter your email address. What's your email address? Good question. Go up to your Gmail tab and find it. It should be your first and last name at airportschools.com. So go do that now. Okay. I put in Joshua Wright at airportschools.com. This is just an example, guys. And I'll click Don't Ask Me Again. you got to confirm the email address. Do it twice. There's a terms and conditions here. I'm gonna go ahead and scroll all the way down. I have read the terms and conditions and click submit. Go ahead and do that first. And you will see that you have your own, it's called an EDP. This right here is called career cruising. You have to complete the tasks and it will tell you which types of careers are good for you, okay? Uh, different types of careers, for example, a curator, ex exhibit designer, a librarian, a tour guide. Some of you like to work with your hands, some of you like to work uh, on computers. And if you take this quiz in here, I'll show you how to do it, it will tell you what you like to do and it might guide your career in the future. So let me find out what's next on this website and I'll show you. All right, I'm figuring this out as I go as well. So this is what I want you to do. I want you to click on this assessments tab and it's called a matchmaker. So let's go ahead and start the matchmaker. And here's the instruction. You will be asked 39 questions. Read each one carefully. Once you have finished answering the questions, the career matchmaker will look for careers that suit your answers. Here's how you answer. For each question, there are five different ways to choose. You dislike this very much. You dislike this. It doesn't matter to me. I like it, and I really like it a lot. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start now for Joshua. Oh, it asks for... Write the name of your session. I'm just gonna type Josh. Okay, it doesn't matter what name, as long as you don't forget it. And I'm gonna click start now. Here it is. Uh, where's the first question? Oh, how, here it is. How would you like a career which includes working with children? Do I dislike working with children very much? Do I dislike it? Do I doesn't matter to me? Or I like it, and I like it very much. Now I am online with Joshua's login here. I don't know what Joshua is going to do, but it's up to Joshua, and I want you guys to make your own decisions. But this is what I want you to what I want you to see how it looks like. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and click dislike for Joshua. And there's his progress tab. You see it has to keep going and going and going. Eventually he'll have all 39 questions. That's only gonna be small progress for the larger tab here. There's multiple sessions of this. Next question, how would you like a career which includes working outdoors in any weather? I'm gonna pretend I'm Joshua and I'm gonna say yes, I like that. If you need help reading these things guys, I'm pretty sure you can highlight these, being interested in using history, that's what it says. And you can have Google speak it to you, all right? If you highlight certain words and you click the speak it button down in the corner of your Google tab, I'm not on a Chromebook today, it should be able to read that to you. If it doesn't read it to you and you struggle reading this, ask an adult for help, because this is important. 
Now, what I want you to know about that is this is mandatory for all eighth graders. If we were in school, in the building right now, in Mr. Novoselsky's class, because we all go to it, this is something that we would be doing as a group in his class. That's 110%. And I am doing it with you online this way because there was norm normally a person will come into our classroom and, and teach us about how to do this. Her name is Mrs. Parrish. She comes in every year. She's a wonderful person. Uh, she gave me all your logins. So thank you to her for that. And I'm going to send you these logins. You're going to log in yourself. And you're going to try to do it the best of your ability on your own. There's multiple sessions. Okay, we're only, I'm only showing you part one. And I want you to do part two, part three, and fill, fill in all the questions with your best answers that relate to you. Don't just take guesses on this. At the very, very end of each session or all your sessions, it should tell you and match you to specific careers. Okay, this is called career cruising. It's to guide your future of what you might do in the future. I didn't ever think I was going to be a teacher. I just never thought I was going to be one. And your, th your thoughts change over time. But I tell you one thing. I do like working with my hands. I like working with tools. And I like being active all day. So that's not a good job for me to be at a desk all day on a computer. I really can't do it. I struggle with that. So make sure when you answer these questions on the computer that you answer honestly. There's no right and wrong answer. Just try your best to get through it. Do not rush through this. This is your only homework for the next couple of days, and I'll be checking in with you. Did you hear that? I said this is your only homework for the next couple of days. That's awesome. That means I really need you to focus on it. We're not reading about turtles. We're not doing any brain pops. I want you to focus on this. Now, if you're Tiki or Madison, and you're a seventh grader, I might have separate assignments for you. I might send those out to you directly, keep you busy. Um, I'll have you two do 20 minutes of Imagine Math and 20 minutes of Imagine Learning every day. And I'll, I'll talk to you, I'll update you on what's going on, but right now I, do, I don't want you seventh graders to do this assignment. This is eighth grade only, okay? And that's it. That's it. If you have any questions, reach out to me. I will send you your career cruising login codes. And I will put this video on YouTube Monday morning. You'll get it. I'll message you all on Google Hangouts. And I want to know if you guys are doing this or not. I will find out. And I need to know if you are because you have to do it. Okay. I wish you the best of luck. If you need help, contact me. Thank you. I'll see you.